It's really exciting. I love every minute of it. I've been doing it a long time, too. I've been doing it for years. It really takes a whole lot of hand-eye coordination. I mean, you, you really just get in the zone sometimes. Whoa, wait a minute. I'm, uh, I'm talking about my artwork. I really can't remember the first time that I picked up a pencil and started drawing, but I know it was, I think, around five years old, and I remember drawing Superman all the time, constantly drawing Superman, and I really figured on having some sort of career in art. I, I really fantasized about being a, a comic book artist, a uh, comic book cover artist. I think everybody probably has a nine and a half foot tall Credible Hulk in their house somewhere. Somehow, I got sidetracked into wrestling, just wanted to have one match, and then I'd go back to my art career. Here, almost 40 years later, I'm still doing the wrestling, and, and art has kind of been put on the back burner, so to speak. But now, lately, I've, I've, I've picked up some gigs doing what I wanted to do originally, and that's comic book covers. I've done uh, the two covers now for WWE Heroes comic book, a couple of wrestling comic books, Headlock. I've worked on one for a Green Hornet comic book. I've got a Zorro cover coming out. I get inspired when I see somebody else's artwork and I challenge myself when I see a really nice piece of art to see if I can paint it or uh, draw it as good as the original artist. I've done a lot of work in, in the Frank Frazetta style and just because, I mean, you know, to me he was the best. I've always loved pinup art. Gil Elfgren was probably my all-time favorite pinup artist and this is just a, a painting of a, a painting that Gil Elfgren had done. When I look at this painting, I look at the brush strokes that I did in her hair and the brush strokes for her eyelashes and sometimes you, you know, you just get that with one sweep of your brush and you go, wow, I just did that with one stroke. I'm still excited about the future as far as my art goes, especially in the in the comic book industry. Now I go around the country and work a lot of comic book conventions, which are going on in different cities almost every single weekend. I'm got upcoming San Diego Comic Con. I'm going to be doing that for the first time. To do some work for DC Comics, to do a Superman cover, that might be it. If I ever get that, I'll call you guys up and say, hey, I think I've done it all now. <laughs>